Another interesting fact about light and minerals and, and let maybe easy water in Pollock's book, he talks about how you can build easy using minerals. Yes. Fine. Yes. Calcium, magnesium, zinc. Um, Very important. Or a few that he had mentioned. So to, to my mind, right, maybe if we take a step back and understand that life itself is this weird dance and interaction between light and the elements. That's really what it is. And we can see this in everyday life we can see this with like pigments that are you that that are made from minerals and metals when they're illuminated we see we are sort of made aware of what you know what that element is through light right and so mm -hmm. i think the this conversation of light and and minerals and elements and more broadly is really a conversation about life itself and you know there's another really interesting uh, thing that I was reading, um, gosh, maybe two years ago or a couple of years ago, but like in certain nocturnal animals, um, zinc allowed for the evolution of their night vision, right? So we're, we're even going back maybe even deeper into the question of like life itself, evolutionary changes that have occurred over time are facilitated by this interaction of light and minerals, right? Um, so it goes even deeper and it gets into like, almost like a philosophical conversation at, at a certain point. But, but it really is. And it is because, you know, and I, this is sort of one of my gripes with like functional and integrative medicine is that, I mean, a lot of people just have no circumspection about the fact that with all the tools in the modern MD toolbox, you can make people feel and behave however you want them to. Mm -hmm. You want to be laser focused. We've got a drug for that. You want to be recovering from your workouts like your Wolverine. Jay Campbell mm -hmm. literally has a stack of peptides and, and supplements that he calls the Wolverine stack. You want to be a 75 year old man with a testosterone level of a 25 year old man. You can do that. Mm -hmm. And I have this conversation with men who, for example, want to go on testosterone or women who are interested in bioidentical hormones. And I just say, look, these have a very profound effect on how you feel and function. And the minerals are the same way. And that's why we talk about them like zinc, the masculine, gentle masculine mineral. People will notice these shifts in their personalities when you put your finger on the scales of what's coming in with things like right. zinc, copper, manganese, all that, these other things. That reinforces this notion of the importance of that. Yes. Because you can elicit such profound changes with minerals and light, right? Tweaking those two variables, especially mm -hmm. that says something about how they're used by life to right. sustain and procreate and all of that. And that is also, I think, why there's such an agenda from the powers that be that want to disempower people and who want to uh, misinform people that these minerals and metals and hormones aren't foundational. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can just take this pill. You can just, it's fine. Just mm -hmm. you know, paper over the problem, patch this tire for another five, 10 miles. Don't worry about the underlying state of your, your condition and your minerals and your light, mm -hmm. your light environment. And that's why like clockwork, every testimonial I collect, I ask every single person the same question or same series of questions. And one of them is what gets the credit for your improvement? Mm -hmm. And then I want them to give me a percentage. It's like, what percentage of it was the group coaching? What percentage of it was the light therapy? What percentage of it was hormones or supplements or this or that. And nothing gets the lion's share almost ever. I've had like one case where somebody said 99% of my improvement was the supplements. Mm -hmm. He hadn't gone to a single group coaching call. He got that improvement with like overnight with one supplement protocol mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and he was blown away. And it was actually two supplement protocols, both of which he had astonishing results with. So it's very important for people to understand that all of this information is being suppressed and called misinformation or disinformation. Like we, right. had, we had a video removed from YouTube yesterday.